Yep. Oh, okay. Then do your thing. And then I wait. Okay. Let me see. Now, would I go in this way or would I go into? No, I'll go this way, huh? Do, 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 do. Got it. Now this would be my chat if anybody comes inside, right? Mm-hmm. And if I, where can I put this so I can do this sort of thing here? Here? Does that look like a good spot to read it? Mm hmm Denver Metro Audits. Hey there, can you hear me? Am I coming through? My cable's in the way though. That's not good. Dang it. Okay. That's the only person in here, right? Well, you're going to get a private show, private live stream just for you. Yeah, we are in Vando City. Just go oh. left. No track. No track. And Matthew the King is lurking, which is good. Um, I am testing out the new setup, which is the way my new drone is going to fly as soon as it's finished being built. So this is going to fly completely differently than what I'm used to. It's the controllers are going to be much more reactive and uh, I'm just a beginner so you'll have to bear with me and yes you are allowed to laugh or comment when I crash. <laughs> That's allowable. Okay. Do, 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 do. We're waiting for it to load. Hey, Margaret. It's good to see you. Thank you for coming in. You get to see me fly badly. Yes, it'll be fun. It's just practicing. All right. The instructions are to um, fly modestly at uh, medium speed, medium altitude. Don't try anything crazy just get used to the control so oh that takes off quickly doesn't it whoa all right here we go hey Jose here we go for some crazy flying today let's see if I can figure this out all right all right we're moving along we're not crashing we're doing the thing Okay, let's see. Okay. Oh no, mayday, mayday. We're diving at the ground. Oh no, no, no. Ooh, oh, we made it. All right. Doesn't it look glitchy? What is going on? Can we do a turn, a sharp turn between the buildings? Sideways? Sideways? No? Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Okay, this flies completely differently than the old drone. This is uh, going to take some getting used to. Let's see if we can make it through here. Oh, no. <laughs> we didn't make it through there. We bumped into it. Dang it. All right. Let's try something else. Let's see. My computer is glitching a little. All right. We made it between those trees. Well, it didn't die. All right. Can we make it under the tractor? Can we do it? Can we do it? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. But the new drone's going to have much more powerful motors than the other one. The other drone was very lightweight, wasn't very strong. And uh, because of that, the wind would grab it. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Aha! I made it through. The, did you see that, people? Did you see that? <laughs> I made it through that cement tube. I shocked myself. <laughs> That's usually a crash for sure. <laughs> Ooh, someone gave you a DJI Mini. Those are nice. Those are nice. Um, my new system is digital as well. Before, DJI was like the only digital system out there. Um... So it basically had the market. Ooh, ooh. Um, 
but the walk snail system um, it's not the drone itself but it's the sending and receiving of video and um, and to the controller um, that's digital instead of analog and some people who are the FPV pilots who do racing and tricks and stuff don't really like digital because there is a like a 30 millisecond lag compared um, to analog but the thing is is if you're a new pilot and your brain is not even gonna notice that lag time you're not gonna hi princess OPD but your brain won't even notice any sort of lag time it's someone who's very experienced that's gonna notice the difference but the good thing about digital is you don't get the static you get a much clearer broader picture whereas analog can have like the old snow lines like TVs um, so I'm going to go for the that tiny bit of lag time but uh, it's not gonna make any difference I'm a slow pilot um, I'm going for the clearer picture Let's see, let's see, we go the other, turn around and go this way. Whoop, whoop, stop, down. Yeah. Let's see if we can do some turns without crashing. Can we do some turns? Can we do some turns? Oh, 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 oh. All right, all right. I made it through there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's see how long I can go without actually crashing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Don't hit the light pole. Don't hit the light pole. <laughs> okay. I made it. I made it past the light poles. <laughs> uh. And you do get that um, with digital um, flying. You can get those little jumps in your picture sometimes um whoa i made it through again yeah All right. practicing is doing simple tricks like um just a uh, one single back and try and land uh back in the same spot like not oh have to roll over Kill the power aileron. It didn't give me credit because it was too slow. You have to be able to do it as if it's like one motion for it to give you credit. But I'm just trying to do that for the first time yesterday. So I try it again. Let's see. Over, upside down. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Nope. <laughs> that wasn't even close. <laughs> Let's see. And it's funny, like sometimes I'll make it through all these obstacles and do some crazy flying, and then it's like one tree out in the middle of nowhere that you should never hit, and I'll smack straight into it. It's like, well, that sucked. Mm, let's see. Uh, yeah, doing the turns between a building, like big wide turns are easy. But trying to do a sharp, sharp turn and not like drift off into smack into the side of the building is hard. Got to stop it by doing the little tip, little tilt it to try to stop it from drifting. Yeah. Hi, Frosty's Gaming. Nice to see you in here. Thank you for coming in. You could come see me practicing my flying. And hopefully nobody gets motion sick. So you can look at it. Laurent? Aileron. Whoops. Whoops.
Let's see. Uh, what is going on up here? Flying into the sun. I can't see. Oh no. Ooh. I dip through it sideways. This is side dip. Those are my technical terms. I don't think other pilots use those terms. <laughs> okay, well, let's see if we can go through here. Kind of an up angle, and yeah. And let's dive. How close to the ground did I get? Wow. Hey, Jeff B. Good to see you. I'm sorry if I can't read all the comments. Uh, because, uh, yeah, I'm trying to look at what I'm doing. Okay. Let's see if we can go through here. Well, no. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Roy, thank you for coming in. Uh-oh. Roy, thank you for coming in here. This is not the beautiful ocean waves. This is some crazy shenanigans. <laughs> I haven't been chatting the last couple of days in anybody's channel. Because, uh-oh, my game is glitching. What the hell? Um, because I was blocked from YouTube. Um, I have two accounts. I have Eat Your Broccoli and Hug Life. And Hug Life may have made a comment in joking that was not within the guidelines. And someone reported it. And so, uh, yeah, Hug Life was on warning. And then someone who was just joking around with me, playing around, um, kept timing me out as a joke. And I guess YouTube thought if I was getting timed out, then I absolutely must not be listening to the guidelines like I was supposed to. And they blocked me and sent me an email. And then somebody reported a bunch of comments for Eat Your Broccoli and got her blocked as well. But after they reviewed the comments, they like unblocked eat your broccoli completely so I'm good but hug life um, I'm afraid that she's uh, still on warning so she's probably not going to comment for a while because I don't want to lose that account um, but they're both unblocked as of today and I don't know who did it because somebody was just mad at me I guess or doesn't like me decided that they would see if they could get me kicked off YouTube. But I guess, too, though, they're looking into that person because they, like, reported seven comments of Eat Your Broccoli. And after they looked at all the comments, they're like, no, those were within guidelines. So they're looking at the person that reported it. Oh, <laughs> I didn't make it through there clean that time, did I? Hi, George. Uh, as you can see, George, I'm back. And George, I know you don't like heights, so maybe you should look at just chat and not look at my... Because maybe my flying will make you sick. <laughs> Especially because it's not that smooth, is it? <laughs> yeah. Power loop. Oh, they called it a backflip. Steve Harloa, thank you for coming in. It's good to see you. Practicing my aileron rolls, my front and back flips. I haven't gotten down any really good combination tricks yet. 
Um, that would be more of a medium skill. I'm not there yet. Um, but I just want to be able to fly my drone in the real world and not be like cutting through the bushes or trees for it to find it. Um, right now, everywhere that we normally go fly is flooded from all the rain. So it's like, that would be a lake. Whoop. <laughs> Devil. <laughs> Delayed Devil. The game, though, is kind. So when you accomplish some tasks, even though they're not really that good. That was supposed to be a, okay, I got to do this right. Try to keep it level and do a yaw turn. Uh-oh, I, I exceeded my altitude. Dive, dive, dive. There we go. Hi, Jodify. Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. I call you Jodify. I apologize. The very first time I saw your name, I saw Jody F.I. And I called you Jodify in my head. I saw immediately it was F.J. And instead of just calling you Jodify, I can't get out of my head that you're Jodify. So I apologize for that. I try and just say Jody. Because I'm a dummy and want something stuck in my head. It's hard to... I will... In my head, I'll say Jodify, not Jodify, it's Jody, and then I'll say it out loud and be like, oh, hello, Jody, because <laughs> I'm a dummy. <laughs> Don't hit the billboard. No. <laughs> I've tried to, like, follow the street. Like, you should be able to do that. Like, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me get over here. You should be able to follow the street, not the tree. <laughs> <laughs> follow the street follow the street follow the street in a circle I can't do it make one complete circle please that is it's so hard to do Ugh, now I feel dizzy and sick <laughs> I don't want to try that anymore that's not fun that's making me sick <laughs> I don't want to spin It's hard at first um, to not get disoriented in the space that you're flying in. It's very tricky to realize like where you are. If you're upside down or doing something, you know, to not get disoriented and goof up. Can I make it through? Uh, yes. Pink taco. Damn it, you got me in trouble. <laughs> I blame you, Big Taco. <laughs> oh, hey, Angel Sin. Good to see you in here. I made it through the cement tubes like twice, Angel Sin. I was so proud. It was a proud, proud moment. <laughs> uh oh. Can I light it up? Can I do it? Can I do it? Can I do it again? Can I do it? Can I do it? No, no, oh, no. <laughs> I smacked it to the side. <laughs> oh, well, I tried. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, let me see. Okay, I'm going to try the, um, I try the S splits again. Okay, we're going to roll back, kill power, A no. Not quite. We're gonna roll back. Kill power. Turn. Oh, too much. Too much. I don't know what it gave me credit for, but that wasn't. It wasn't good. <laughs> I tried. Dang it. Okay. Just some some basic skills, right? That's what I should do. Just do a aileron, over it, rolled it, aileron. That was good. That one was good. Let's see. Let's see if we can, okay, just a back flip. Whoops, overdid it. Front flip. Oh, that was slow. That should have been a flip flop or whatever they call it. Pink taco, 
I've never been reported like that before anywhere else. Somebody went on your channel and reported every comment I made on every video that, um, that I was there for. So it was somebody who was just looking in your channel. Uh-oh, uh-oh, what? Uh, made it. So I'm not sure if they're mad at you, mad at me. Uh-oh. <laughs> drum dad. Drum dad. Uh, drum dad. Okay. Wow, there is such a delay because I'm just watching that crash now on my screen. Okay. Up. And here we go. Here we go. Uh, nope. Oops. Sorry. Angelson, my computer is being super glitchy. Like my video feed is being glitchy. I think I have too much stuff on. Um, trying to run this through the oh, yeah, crash and burn. There's always a little crash and burn in drone flying. It's part of the game, especially when you're learning and, it's, and trying to learn something new. Like if you just fly around at a medium altitude and you fly at a slow speed and you do nothing and you're just like oh do 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 you're not going to crash my computer is getting old yeah well that's true but if you don't try to do anything you're not going to crash it's when you try to do maneuvers it's like, oh, let's try to go through here. Yeah. Oh, let's avoid that. Let's do a turn close to the ground. Let's do some skipping along the ground. Yeah. Do you see it glitching now? Like the screen glitching? I was looking at the chat. <laughs> Drones bounce too. And you'll find. See that glitch? Woo. Um. If you'll find that if you try to fly at a low speed, it's much higher, uh, harder to maintain a nice even altitude you tend to you know bop up and down like a horse ass <laughs> when you first start doing it until you learn to hover well so it's like okay let me just slow down my speed and just kind of kind of hover around see if I can keep from going up and down okay I don't want to do that Uh-oh. 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 Just in the stream or on... No, it's on my screen, too. It, that's the way it's flying in the game. It's like... It's... Uh, what do you call it? It's like... Uh, jumping. It's like pausing, jumping forward. So it's making it hard to fly. You think it's because too many things are on? Dive the tower? How am I going to dive the tower? I'm not on top of the tower. You want me to go up high? And I could dive down in the middle of nowhere. But I don't know how I'm going to get up close to the tower. Uh, dive, 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 dive. <laughs> okay. Do you see how glitchy it is, though? Like, it could cause a problem with reaction to 
not hitting anything to try to fly through stuff it's like glitching that's a good thing to blame it on right I tried to do that S split maneuver, but I only did it uh, once that it gave me credit. I was doing it too slow the other time, and it was it it didn't acknowledge. It was like that's three separate maneuvers, not one. Okay, I'll attempt it again. Okay, over kill the pot. Oops, I went all the way around. Sorry. Whoops. <laughs> I have a lot of stuff running, yeah. That's probably the problem. But what could I turn off? Well, and two, the, um, it did just all update right before I started doing this. No. <laughs> Oops. Oops. Sorry. It is really bad. Oh my gosh, I can't fly. Ugh, ugh. Yes, most pilots keep their head and shoulders still. Um, if you'll notice, I'm bobbing and dancing all over the place. That's because I try to duck. <laughs> and, and that does not make your drone duck. <laughs> so it's not beneficial. <laughs> but I do it anyway. <laughs> like you look like a crazy person out there trying to duck no wrong angle I'm not gonna make it through no. <laughs> okay stop it stop it get control of this sucker Get control of this sucker. I noticed it was glitching a little bit even when I played my game, but it's more extreme uh, doing it with the OBS running and the VoIP character running. and So it's even more extreme now, but it was glitching even when I was just playing the game by itself. Haha, I made it through the tunnel, but <laughs> it crashed into the next one. <laughs> I'm breakdancing. Woo! Hey, Dill Hall. <laughs> nice to see you. Ducking does help, doesn't it? Okay. You want me to dive the tower? How am I going to dive the tower? I'm going to go straight up and then flip backwards. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Try to dive down the side of the building. <laughs> uh oh, buffering. I don't see it buff. Oh, yeah, it looks all pixely. Looks like crap. Yeah, it does. That's not what I'm seeing on my screen, of course, but that's what it looks like on my live stream. Ning it. Ning it. That's no fun can't see what I'm doing and it's blurry. I mean, it's bad enough if you have to look at what I'm doing. <laughs> but looking at it blurrily, should I cut it off? OBS with the VC and the game is a lot for my computer. Yeah. It's old computer. It worked good when you were flying and you are doing it.
Yeah, I didn't say anything bad on any of the comments on your channel, Pink Taco. And after YouTube reviewed it, I was like explaining to them my comments. I didn't bully the channel creator. I didn't bully any of the other commenters or even the people in the video. I simply stated my opinion of the behavior of the people in the video. That was it. And after they reviewed it, they're like, yeah, you're right. And they unblocked me. So. But you timing me at Hug Life out about 20 times in a row after she got a warning and her the account was flagged. They're like, oh, she must not be taking uh, heed to that warning. She must not be listening. Because she's getting timed out constantly. So they had to go back and look in like four different channels where you timed me out to see what, and my comments were high. I'm like, hey, so and so. And they're like, oh, yeah, you didn't say anything wrong. I was like, no, it was a joke. It's like, it was just a joke between me and the person timing me out. I was like, I wasn't doing anything bad. Ugh, that's making me sick. It's too glitchy. Let's crash. Oh, let's crash. <laughs> you're outside the game area. Your altitude's too high. I just thought I'd do something. Something. Three people reported your last comment for saying, yeah, calling someone a troll. Well, you're bullying them just because it's true. Watch out for that tree. Woo. <laughs> and the fence post. Uh-oh. <laughs> what kind of move was that? <laughs> I know you guys can't even see it. It's like all blurry. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my god. I'm like watching it the live stream while I'm still trying to float around over here. That was a shitty move. tell that you can dip down in these little places here and go through <laughs> but, not, but I can't <laughs> I've heard tell you can make it through those little tunnels but yeah you gotta be perfectly straight perfectly centered and bam no <laughs> I can't do it You never get into trouble, Jeff B. I had never got into any trouble until a couple days ago. And I didn't, whoever did it, whoever reported me is just somebody being a butthole that's mad at me for something, not because I actually did anything wrong. Whoa. Kind of can't even fly down the street. There we go. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. So nice to see you. I don't know how to pronounce your name. Kaya Kaya Pang's official. I hope I I know I'm butchering your name, but thank you so much for being here. You're helping me duck, George. <laughs> thank you so much. Make stupid people think. Always, I did. I appealed. They then uh, emailed me back and asked some questions, and I answered the question. Talked to them about what was. First of all, I told them that most of what they were seeing was me joking with another person. There was no serious comments or somebody's feelings being hurt. Because I was just joking back and forth with somebody that uh, this would be a good opportunity I really think they were hoping that I would think Pink Taco reported my comments on his channel and that it would make me and Pink Taco get into a fight I really think that was the purpose But I can't say for sure. But it was the same person that reported Hug Life and Eat Your Broccoli. All the comments were reported by one person. So it wasn't like multiple people thought I did some horrid, bad thing. It was like, nah, I tried that. Okay, can I fly between the light poles and not hit them? No. <laughs> Maybe a couple. Ugh. I don't think... Uh... Yeah, I think some people think it's a joke like to get your account banned and, oh, you could just start a new one. But... If your account's been around for a long time and people know you and um, you're, you have memberships on channels where you're supporting people, um, it's not a joke to get your... Ah! I hit a tree. Sorry. It's not a joke to get your account banned and just because you can start another one. It's like Eat Your Broccoli's account has been around since 2013. I didn't have content until a while ago. I was just a supporter, but I don't want that account banned just because somebody feels like being mean. It's not nice. It's not nice to do that. No. <laughs> I keep trying to go over there and line it up to go through the cement tubes. And yeah, it's not happening. Yeah, I hope the real drone doesn't fly this uh, this glitchy. I'll be in trouble. It's just the computer. Man, a computer live stream is crapola. It's like clear for a second and then all pixely and crappy the next second. I'm sorry. I'm trying to look. I'm trying to look at where I'm flying, but at the same time, I'm trying to look at comments. You think driving a car and glancing at a comment here and there is hard? Try flying a drone and hitting up a comment. That's why people were like, well, you could live stream your drone flying out in the real world. And it's like, yes, you can. But you can't read comments because you're not going to risk crashing your drone to read somebody's comment. At least I'm not. Oops. What are we doing? <laughs> are you watching? You trying to see how uh, glitchy this thing is? Mm -hmm. My 
Yeah, it's like flies along like it's working pretty good for a second and then all of a sudden it's like just flying straight. It's like skipping and getting blurry on the live stream. I need more juice. I need a more powerful computer. Yeah, we didn't expect you to be streaming when we... Huh? We didn't expect you to be streaming when we bought your computer. No. See? I did a back flip. <laughs> See? I did a front flip. Back in town. See? I did an aileron roll. Almost. See? Oops. Overdid it. it the <laughs> computer likes it, or the game likes it better if you overdo it a little bit. Because then it gives you credit. It seems like if you just, like, don't do it a little bit. Like, just barely. I want to go through the tube again, but I can't get lined up. <laughs> it's not happening. I'm going to try to do a... Oh, dive at the water. No. <laughs> don't dive at the water. Bloop. See what's going on. Huh? See what's going on. Huh? I see what's going on. You know what's yeah. wrong? Is it fixable or it's just I need a better computer? We might be able to change some of your stream settings to fix it a little bit. All right. Maybe some of your game settings, but it's your computer's just struggling to run all the things. Ah. Uh, Streaming is hard. Well, does it have... Yeah, it likes it better if it's just me sitting talking than doing yeah. this doesn't take as much power to do it's that. It's got to run the game. It's got to overlay the game. It's got to overlay your character. Yeah. It's got to do all of your character tracking. And it's got to compress all of that then send it up to YouTube. Yeah. So it's just all the things together. I'll see if we can get it to... Huh? Okay, I'll see if we can fix our settings to make it light, less light. Ah! <laughs> I think I did the... <laughs> I think I did too sharp of a turn, and I smacked the ceiling. Now I'm bobbing up and down, hitting the light. Oh, okay, calm down. That's what he said. Who said that? <laughs> Who said what? <laughs> You're fourth in a row, wicked folks. Ugh. Okay, let's see if I can get up off the ground here. Yeah, see, it's like, well, I'm trying to fly and look at comments is, that's, that's making me fly even worse. Yeah, all right, I'm going back inside. I okay. To see what it's doing. Okay. My technical person said she might be able to make some adjustments to make this better next time. Or I might have to get a more powerful computer to fly and live stream and do all this. That, especially because I've got the little character in the corner. Did you see that, though? Did you see that? Anybody see that? I made it through four buildings without smacking into anything. I guess you're seeing it now. That's just amazing to me. <laughs> I did it. I did it. I did that. Power loop? Nope. Power loop. Backflip. That was a power loop. I kept the power on the whole time. They didn't give me credit for the power loop, though. They're just like, that's just a... <laughs> Oops. <laughs> okay. Wow. Yeah, I'll be starting over here. <laughs> Earn them wings. <laughs> or the bat is gone. <laughs> well, you know, if you pass the test with the FAA, you can get your pilot's license. You can um, put in through their portal to fly in specific locations. But there is no test that they make you take to see if you actually can fly the thing. If you can fly and do the thing. Which I think that... <laughs> thank God for that. <laughs> thank God for that. 
because they would not give me a license. <laughs> well, you know, they said I couldn't drive a car, so I thought I would fly. <laughs> <laughs> you see my I'm like I, that looks crazy. You see my head turning and bobbing. I was ducking that that pillar. <laughs> Close your eyes, George. No, George, come on, get in here and be my co-pilot. Ride or die, bitch. Ride or die. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Please keep all arms, legs, and belongings inside the drone until we come to a complete crash landing. First responders will be waiting on the tarmac to assist you shortly. <laughs> that's it. That's my flight announcement. <laughs> uh. Oh, light pole. <laughs> Tight gap clear. I cleared it after I bounced off of it. Tight gap cleared. All right. I have on. Uh, <laughs> I have on what's called God mode, um, which is if I smack into a cement pillar, um, which would normally break your props for at least break your props. Um, you would have to like, oh, I got to go put some new propellers on. Um, so you'll start it back at the beginning of the game. Um, because I have God mode on, I kind of bounce off of stuff, float around, and if I can get control of the drone again, I'm good to go. <laughs> no props broken. I did good, right? <laughs> did I do the thing? Did I do the thing? Oh, <laughs> did I do the thing? <laughs> You saw a live feed of this two days ago? Not of me flying. If you if you looked at my old live stream, that was my daughter flying, and that's why it was uh, much better. She was doing a much better job than I was. Uh oh. Well, I could go through some leaves and chill up. All right. Boom. That's how I land right there. I just skid to a halt and uh, slide along the ground. That's that's the way I fly. Let's see. I want to where I want to deal. I'm going to fly somewhere else. And she yeah. Play this on it. This is a gaming computer, but it's old. It does have, um, it has a video card in it that's, you know, was top of the line five years ago. That's got to finish my real drone since it's done right. Yes. Angelson is building my real drone. Okay. Wow, I'm uh, in here. The challenge is to take off and not smack into anything and make it out that door. And then as soon as you get out of the door, you got to go up and, t oops, up and turn or you'll be out of the play area because it's a very small play area. So you definitely have to turn around. You have to turn around quickly or you're out of the playing area. And actually this computer is uh, enough to play the game by itself. Um, but I have on the Vroid character in the corner. So I have that program running. And then to stream it you know, is using OBS. Um, so that's a lot for this computer. I, but if I just want to play games on this computer, I don't really have a problem with it. But this area here is level... 
And believe it or not, when you're first learning to fly, just hovering and keeping your altitude steady is ex uh, you're just part of a thing that you try to learn to do is to drop down in or to fly up out of obstacles like that. It's like you go into it. You know, Pink Taco, um, one of the things that YouTube said in the email that if somebody's doing a bunch of uh, false reporting, ah, uh, dang it. If someone's doing a bunch of false reporting and when they look at the comments or whatever it is, um, and they're just being malicious doing false reporting, um, that person can get cut off YouTube themselves. So, you know, I gave little Linda a wrench. Um, so if she wanted to come in here and be a moderator or drop links or do something. But I haven't seen her in a minute. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Don't go crooked. Don't. Get out of the, get out the door. And up. Please, up over that crap. There we go. Murphus, I'm so glad you're in here. You can be in here as Murphus or many of the other people that you are. Just happy to see you. Appreciate your support. Oh no! Oh no! Woo. There's a lot of stuff you can do in here, but in this little area, if you're really skilled, but I'm not sk that skilled. I'm just lucky to stay alive over here. Like, not eat it into a big metal bar somewhere. I can go through the tractor, though. I could go through the tractor and make the turn without dumping it in the water now. Before, I used to dump it in the water every time I did that. That's an improvement. And they make you fly into the sun. I can't see. I can't see. The sun is blinding me. Uh-oh, 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 I'm not... Oh, can I make it? Can I make it? Ah! I only smacked into the side once. I'll take that. I'll take that. Oops. Let me see something. Go to Chowder, Florida. There we go. You gotta have some, some sort of moderator, right? You can't have nobody. Okay. Now you see this? You see this door? You gotta make it pass all that stuff? Look at this. I'm gonna like hop. Hop, hop, hop in a circle. <gasps> Look at that. I'm gonna go out the back door. <laughs> That's way easier. <laughs> That's cheating. They line it up, make you think, I gotta be able to skilled enough to get out of this dang building. And I just sort of hop on the ground in a little circle. <laughs> and I'll go out the back door. But George, no timing anybody out because if somebody's already on warning, and you time them out, it could get them blocked from YouTube. So, no timing out is a joke. Because it could actually cause harm. I found that out the hard way. I wonder if I could curve it and go through here. Why not? Or through here. Ha, 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 ha. I did dodge it. 
I wonder. I wonder. Oh, I'm not going straight. Will I make it? Will I make it? Oh, oh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to look back at this live stream to see how ridiculous my head ducking and weaving is trying to fly. When I go out in public, if somebody's watching me fly, they'll probably be like, this girl's crazy. What is she doing? I don't know how you just hold yourself in a steady position, though. If you see that you're going to smack into something. Ooh, I did a drop down. You see that you're going to smack into something. It's natural to duck, right? But no, you duck with your thumbs, not your actual head. Yeah, you can't get you can't get timed out a bunch of times pink taco for no reason because YouTube will think, "Oh, you're under warning and you're not listening." That's why you're getting timed out. And maybe all you said was hi to somebody, but if someone's timing you out for a joke, it could get you that could be like the final straw and get you blocked. Oh, <laughs> oops, oops. Oh no, damn. I just went for a swim and it doesn't have submarine mode. That would be kind of cool if it did though, wouldn't it? Be like go from flying a drone up in the sky and just dive it down and be like oh submarine mode see some fish or something I don't know and I'm back to the start and I'm gonna try and go out the right way and then I'll try and come out this way and curve it around and go up to not hit that there we go we're back in the air wonder what's going on up here. I'm going to fly through this stuff. Try and turn it. Turn it. Turn it. Turn it around. Turn it around. Try. Ooh, no, no, no. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> I don't know what gap I cleared. I just was like, okay, I'm beside this thing and I didn't smack into it. They're giving me credit for that. Oh. <laughs> Okay, okay, watch this. That is just. And she, like, can fly through. See those little. I don't know if you can see them yet, but see there's, like, little loops of wire hanging there or something? Oh, shit, I made it through. I can't believe I did that. First time. <laughs> she could fly through it with confidence, though. She could fly through these little. Whatever these little loopy things are on the top of these bars. Oops, I can't. <laughs> I, I can't. <laughs> it's too small. I don't fit. Is this making you motion sick, George, or are you okay? Okay, drop it down. But, aww. Dang it. Hi, Realist. How are you? Good to see you. Thanks for coming in here. George dropping the legs. Thank you, thank you. Got you working, huh, George? I know, turn back. See, they make it so that the way that you take off, you instantly are out of the gameplay area. So you gotta come out of that stupid thing and do like a super sharp turn the second you get out. Look, flying over water. That's dangerous. No. You hear that sound bleep? Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh no. Don't do it. 
Don't dive into the water. Ah! Ah! Get out of there! <laughs> Get out of there! It's dangerous in there! Don't fly down between the containers. There's not enough room. Can you dive out this hole right here? Oh! Yes, you can. <laughs> can you do it? I don't know. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Can you fly between these wires? Can you do it? Nope. No. No. <laughs> no. The answer is no. The swimsuit. Yeah. You need a... I wish it wasn't all pixely, though. I wish it went... I died right there. I died. Ugh. Tight gap, yes. That's that's a, the first thing you learn is to hover, and then you learn to um, do some like medium altitude flying and turning, and then the next step after that would be to fly through some gaps, and then you learn to do like some drop downs where you drop down into stuff and fly out of it, like that oh but you don't hit the t <laughs> you, don't hit you don't hit stuff i don't even know where i'm at where am i um drop downs or you fly into it and then fly up out of it you do a basic uh back flip front whoops that was overdone front flip but you don't overdo it that was like one and a half Front flip. No. No. <laughs> where am I? Where am I? Oh, where am I? What? Where am I? <laughs> you gotta practice that stuff and get just a, a, like, have a spot on the horizon that you're looking at. And, uh, do that full, whoa, do that full rotation going to the moon. <laughs> I don't do all this stuff when flying my real drone out uh, side. I'm, uh, because, yeah, I wouldn't fly around all these containers and um, break my new drone. But I, I do have my built-in excuse. This is only the second time I've flown this drone setup. This drone setup is going to fly like the drone that's being built. So it has way more power goes faster um it's kind of like if you're turning your steering wheel like halfway to change lanes and then all of a sudden you had a steering wheel that's only going to do quarter of a turn to change lanes the sticks are uh, set up so they're it's much more reactive tighter um so you got to be much uh more minimal and Drop it down and out. There we go. I did it. You got to be more precise with your movements. Um, so it's definitely going to take me a minute to get used to the new one. Um, yeah, I think I had enough of this one. This is hard. This is hard. Not yet. What not yet? I don't have it yet. We don't want to quit quit. Wait a minute. Cancel. I want to go to level selection. Let's see. Where do I want to go? The green. You guys want to go to the golf course? Alright. You're saying not yet. Are you saying that the real drone is going to be even not doing these tricks in the real world try no i'm not ready to try it yet in the real world for sure um i know that not yet do, 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 do. it takes a minute to load 
Do, 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 do. But that's why we practice it on the computer so we don't bust up a bunch of equipment that costs a lot of money and is a lot of work and time. So if we go out in the real world with the new drone set up, we're going to fly a medium altitude at a medium speed and do just some basic slow turns. Yeah. That's what we'll do. We won't do this. We won't try this and be like, oh, let me lift off and see if I can make it through this tree gap. <laughs> I don't, this is gap clear, but I think I smacked into it, don't you? I think I hit that. I don't think that I made that exactly. I think it gave me credit for something. Ugh. Hey, hey, look at this, a golf course, we can fly low to the ground, kind of open, as long as you can avoid the trees, there's more space, there's a bigger game area. What do you think? Can I make it through there? Whoop! <laughs> I made it through the tree bridge, but it smacked into some leaves. They needed trimming. These trees need a little trimming. That's what it is. Okay. Let me try it again. Wait, 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 wait. Can I make it through there? Ho, ho! I did. I made it through, sort of. Made it through the branches. I just smacked a few leaves. That's okay, right? Oh, that one I made clean. Well, this is interesting. There's lots of stuff sitting around here. This is where they would be telling you, get the hell out of here, away from our vehicles. <laughs> get away from here. You can't fly that over here. We're going to trespass you from this golf course. <laughs> get out of here. You can't fly here. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. No. Wow. Bonk. Leaves don't count. Not if your drone motor is strong enough, it just grinds it up, right? Just makes a little mulch. <laughs> I think I flew sideways into something. I didn't even see that coming. Okay. Let's try the S split again. We go over, upside down, kill the power. I went all the way down, didn't I? I did a full flip. Never mind. I want to try and do that one. It's so hard. Okay. We're up. We're going to turn over. Kill power. Oops. Ah, I did it again. I'm doing a full loop instead of doing an aileron turn out of it. Okay. Let's try again. Get up here. Go. Okay. Start to go over. Kill power. Upside down. There, uh, uh, almost, almost, <laughs> almost, <laughs> almost is only good in horseshoes and hand grenades, not in drone flying. Okay, one more time. Okay, we're moving along here, upside down, kill power. See, you need to be like here, and then not. <laughs> Maybe I don't need to practice S splits right now. <laughs> what should I practice in this big open area? Follow the trail. Try to follow the trail. Close to the ground. Follow that trail. Follow. <laughs> no. <laughs> this is mean. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, it would be like, let me chase down some golfers. Could you imagine how pissed off they would be? You like took off after some golfers, buzzed above their while they're trying to make their shot. <laughs> I can imagine they take their game very seriously. Don't hit the tree, Trun. Don't hit the tree. All right. See, I went underneath the tree. I did something. I did some little some something. Okay. Let's let's see. Let's just go straight ahead. Spot a tree and oh, I try to see if I could uh, over aileron. Ah! <laughs> Gotta play Flight of the Valkyries. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, that one was pretty good. Ah, overdid. Not quite enough. Alright, that was a good one. Alright, that one was good too. I'm trying to practice the little maneuvers. Let's see if we can fly towards that tower. Do a back flip. Ugh. A little glitch. Front flip. Oh, too far. Uh-oh. Altitude. Dive, 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 you fool. Uh-oh. Let's see if we can... F can we... F can we fly through there? <laughs> maybe, maybe not. <laughs> Power loops. Oh, because I didn't cut the engine. Yeah. I know. I the games call them a backflip because it's doing it fast. So you gotta if you kill the power before you start the backflip. Like that. Is that how you do them? Because if you can still hear the motor going, you know I didn't kill the power and do it right. Whoops. 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 <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I think I should be able to fly through this tower. Those, light, those wires are not really lined up, are they? Oh, wait, wait. Ah, I did it. I did it. I guess you can. Okay. Did I do it right that time? Too fast? I killed the power too soon? Do you kill it at the same time? Like, do you start the flip, kill the power, or do you kill the power at the exact same time you start the flip? What do we do here? I want to learn to do it right. And I know I haven't been using my throttle control correctly. We can fly to the strip club now? Yeah! Because <laughs> I want to see some strippers. <laughs> I flipped too fast. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Kill the power, back flip. Now I lose all my altitude. Then I'm power looping, and even though the power wasn't on. Throttle down when you're upside down. Okay, upside down. Oops, I went too far. Well, I did the power right. I just didn't. I over flipped. Okay. So I go upside down, kill the power. There. Was that one good? That one was good. Hey, Charlie Norris. Who the heck let you in here? <laughs> Chuck. Watch me do this terrible backflip, okay? Roll over, kill the power. Oops, I went too far. 
<laughs> but it gave me credit. <laughs> the game is generous. That was closer. It was still too fast. Okay. Okay. Let's try it again then. Okay. Well, the last one was really bad. Okay. I'm going to roll over. Kill power. No. That was bad too. Ugh. Am I supposed to kill power in an aileron roll too? So I don't dive at the ground. Ah! <laughs> oh, let's just fly at the ground. Then I don't have to worry about it. I'm already there close to the ground for the crash. I'm already here. It's not far to crash. What's going on over here? Can we fly through this? Can we fly through this? Oh, no. What's that? Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> what was that? What was, what was that? <laughs> Start over. Game over. Mr. Bean? Dang. Mr. Bean's on fire with the links. Dang. Okay. There we go. It was a wall. Yeah, it, yeah, you can't fly into walls. That doesn't work out well, does it? I did a good flip there, though. That one was pretty good. I lost a little altitude. Yeah, George. Send <laughs> me the chat. Okay, how about a front flip? Oh. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. Try that again. Okay. I need some speed. I can't be like dead stopped. Okay. Front flip. Kill power. <laughs> front flip. Front flip. Front. Hey. I like the trees. The trees are fun. Alright. I'm done trying that. Practice, practicing flips is over. I suck today. Let's follow the dirt path. Try not to hit the trees. Let's follow the dirt path. Uh oh. And then it curved around too much. I've lost the path. They said I cleared a gap, but I don't think I did. Trying to follow the path. Follow the path. Uh oh, going too fast. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, that path turned and I can't make that turn. See, I can make this turn. <laughs> Does that make you sick or what? <laughs> uh oh, the computer's complaining again. And say, like, we can't do this. No, no, don't do it. <laughs> don't do it, don't do it, don't dive. Ah! <laughs> My computer's glitching so bad I can't fly anyway. <laughs> I can't see where I'm going. <laughs> Chuck, Pink Taco tried to get me banned from YouTube. He's a stinker. He timed out Hug Life 20 times. I was like, if you get Hug Life banned, she'll have to cancel all her memberships and not be able to support the channels that she does. Like, that's not nice. But I won't, I won't, I won't, <laughs> I won't, I won't. I won't time Pink Taco out because he's in, he's on warning right now. And you can't time people out when they're on warning or they could get in trouble. It would be nice if they lined those wires up so that you could shoot straight through them, but they... See this stuff over here? Like they put all this stuff over here and you think, well, I could fly through that. But generally speaking, you smack into that. Hmm. 
where is all this fence at? It's every time I try and go somewhere, there's a fence there. I don't want to hit the fence. Look how tight the gap is on that tree. I don't think you can make it through that tree. No. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Nor that one. Too many branches. Chuck, are you sure you want to fly FPV? It's hard. It's hard to do. But Chuck, the walk snail system is digital like uh, like DJI. So when you put it in your FPV drone or whatever, you get that nice crystal clear digital picture in your goggles to fly. So you don't get like the um, snow from analog. So it makes it a little nicer. Well, supposedly, I haven't tried it yet, obviously, because it's been dumping rain and everything is a lake. And yeah, even if it's not raining today, but you certainly couldn't go fly unless you wanted to. Uh oh, uh oh, whoa. <laughs> I went through the gazebo. I almost took my head off. It was almost a. Uh, let's go through the tree. Whoop. Yeah. Let's do that. Let's do that. Now over here, we have an arch. But right past the arch is some rows of trees. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, oh, I heard those leaves. Oh, I ducked. Did you see my head duck, Chuck? I've been told <laughs> that that doesn't change the drone position. <laughs> but I do it anyway. I can't help it. I'm a ducker and a dodger. <laughs> I don't think I want to go over there. A little bouncing off the ground. It's all right. Uh-oh, uh-oh, fly through, uh -oh. I'm to fly through there sideways. I was too close. No, no, help, let me get up high. I'm making myself dizzy, damn it. Oh, man, my computer just glitched horribly. Okay, okay. Go upside down. Wow. Wow. YouTube doesn't use it against you when you get timed out if you're not on warning. But if your account's been flagged and you're on warning, like Hug Life got flagged and was on warning, and then Pink Taco timed her out like 20 times in four different channels, like in two days. So they're like, well, Hug Life, obviously, if you're getting timed out 20 times, you're not following the warning that we just gave you so they blocked her and i had to appeal it and then they had to go look at i was getting timed out for saying hi or i got timed out in big man's channel for giving a super sticker i hadn't even chatted in there um and then they're like oh okay we'll just put you back on warning but yeah i think if your account's flagged and you get multiple times out right away after that that youtube catches it but if you're not on warning, I don't think they pay any attention to how many times you're tagged out because they're not looking at your account. Ah! <laughs> Oops. Come on, that was stupid. I'm trying to do some maneuvers. I always do it like... 
halfway or too much or yeah maybe I should go back to playing mini golf <laughs> I had better luck at mini golf or at least I do in my mind I played a really tough game on a new course and I was just plus one over par so am I supposed to kill the power just in an aileron roll? Because, like, you do it that fast. Why would you kill power? You don't have to. Huh? You don't have to. No, I don't have to? Oh, I thought you were trying to say I needed to then, too. I'm like, I don't use my throttle properly. YouTube will never get rid of you, peak. Well... They won't get rid of you because you can just keep making accounts, but you can be Pink Taco 1, Pink Taco A, Pink Taco B, Pink Taco C. <laughs> you can just keep making accounts. So, they can't really get rid of you like that. Uh-oh, what's down here? Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> was that some wild shenanigans right there, wasn't it? <laughs> Is that how you fly, daughter? Mm -hmm. So smoothly. <laughs> mm -hmm. Good, perfect, no notes. Huh? It's good, perfect, no notes. That was perfect, wasn't mm -hmm. it? Yeah, it was. It was smooth. <laughs> <laughs> and I have to look back at this live stream with me flying because I want to see like how badly am I ducking and dodging stuff with my head badly huh let's see we can go under the trees can we go under this tree branch and not hit the trunk or the ground oh we hit a few leaves we're okay we made it we're alive still <laughs> We're still looking. Now let's just see if we can stay level and do a complete spin around. All right. We did that shit. I keep trying to fly through here, but they don't line up the bars. Like the bars are not lined up to go straight through. So you have to... Uh. <laughs> oh, do you see that glitch? Mm -hmm. That wasn't my fault. You have fun with trolls, man. Trolls suck. They can blacklist your IP address. Yeah, I guess they can. My, I would imagine. Oh, Chuck said hi to you. Hi, daughter. She said hi. <laughs> She's waving. She's hiding behind the wall because my um, computer and stuff is inside of a closet. <laughs> I'm in the closet. <laughs> So she's hiding behind the wall as to not um, interfere with my character or whatever. But yeah, I have a walk-in closet that um, I've that is converted to my computer room, my TV room, my <laughs> gaming room for my Xbox and. So I spend a lot of time in the closet. <laughs> How long have I been on here? Mm -hmm. I don't know. My thumbs are getting tired. Can I just land and talk? Or if I switch it to the other thing, will it kick me out? What do you think? If I you switch it off the game, game, will it kick me out? No, you can switch it off the game. Huh? You can switch it off the game. Oh, because I'm tired. I'm like, feel dizzy. Mm -hmm. Let me see. How do I do it? Close your game. Let's close the game. Mm -hmm. I'm a quitter. See that? I'm quitting. But I don't have to switch it over to... Uh... Let's close that. Alright, that's off. And quit. Quit. 
Where am I though? I've lost myself. I don't know, dear. Your little person crashed. Yeah, open it again. Someday we'll teach you to click fast enough. You know what it is? Because I don't bend my um, finger. I'm trying to click flat. And I've always. How do I do this? Mm -hmm. I don't know how to do it. I know. I'm like, help me. Am I in there? Yeah. Oh. Now, how do I get rid of her? I can't click her off, though, can I? No. What do I click on this? Maximize? Yeah. Just click it. Oh. Now I need to find chat. Uh, it's in D or docs. It's in what? Docs, top left. Chat, it's the bottom left. Hey. Ooh, that's weird. That's all black. Hey, Clayborn. Thanks for coming in here. Do I look like I'm sort of sunk down low or something? Like, do you think I should adjust her? It's probably because that window's a weird size now. Can I move her? Hey, Chuck. Hey, Clayborn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to try to say, um, there's, there it is, Chuck. Oh, look, it won't let you do the middle finger. <laughs> because this is a very polite, uh, polite character. So, bye, daughter. I am still in the closet. I will stay in the closet as long as I'm playing. I look pretty hot. Do I, am I, am I, how hot am I? Wait, where's my arms? Where's my, oh, no. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> um, if I put on all the tracking cameras for VR, um, which I, is, I don't do on here, we can go to the strip club and do some dances. You're concerned about those vampire teeth? <laughs> Well, I am a vampire because I have to stay out of the sun. So everybody teased me and said I'm a vampire. So I figured my character should be too. Now I don't have anything to say. I'm done flying. I want to rub my eyes. My eyes are all tired. Think about flying the FPV drone, the one that's set up. It's like five minutes per battery. So, um, yeah, I wouldn't be flying for an hour straight. That kind of makes the eyes tired. A four, a four, a M4M searches on his computer we took. Mm -hmm. Maybe Charlie knows what you're talking about. I don't. Rena Center is for sale. <laughs> An alien for a neck. <laughs> I don't know what you see, George, but I know you see something. <laughs> you're making pictures out of uh, her clothing and her neck, and you're seeing something I don't see. She's got a better neck than I do. My neck's a little shorter. <laughs> I don't have a very long neck. Short people got no reason. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. But I had to get go live. I was like, oh, man. Broccoli's not on warning. Broccoli, like, YouTube said that all of my comments were within guidelines. And so the person reporting me might get in trouble for repeatedly reporting just to be, like, mean to me. And I just don't know who it is because they won't tell you. But somebody doesn't like me. And that makes me want to cry. <laughs> It makes me want to cry. It makes me sad. If somebody doesn't like me. <laughs> and it was from your... Uh, it was from your chat, Chuck. Because I was in your chat. And I told Pink Taco. Oh, I, Hug Life just left a nice comment for you on your channel. And before Pink could get there and look at it. It was... You know who is reporting? 
um, yeah, before Pink could even go look at the comment, it was already removed and uh, Hug Life was on warning. Like, within minutes. I'm like, who's stalking Pink Taco's chat or comments? And, uh, bite them. Ew, they might taste nasty. <laughs> who, Pink, who, who is it? <laughs> um, they, but YouTube won't tell you who's doing it to you. Like, even if they figure out, like, oh, yeah, you're not doing anything wrong. We'll unblock you. You're okay. After you, like, email back and forth with them. They, they don't want to, like, let you know who's doing it. But I was like, are they mad at me? Or are they mad at Pink? Or are they mad at both of us? I, I don't, I can't figure it out. So, I don't know. I don't know. I know, but Pink probably can't. They don't tell you either. You just probably know because... But, you know, if you report comments constantly and they're not verified as um, a reportable comment, um, YouTube said that that person could be taken down for malicious reporting. So, unless all those comments that are being reported are verified um, to be outside of guidelines, that's not a very smart thing to do either. Pink is your only troll. It's got to be... No, they told me that Pink did not report. They said... Because all of the comments that got reported from Pink, uh, or Hug Life, or Eat Your Broccoli were all on Pink's channel on his videos. And they said the content creator did not report you. So I know Pink didn't report me. But I, I don't know who did. So... But Hug Life is still under warning because her comment was a joke, but it definitely was outside of the guidelines, I guess. It was a little bit naughty. <laughs> I said it was just a joke, but they didn't think it was funny. So um, Hug Life is not going to comment anywhere for the next 30 days because she wants to make it through um, that 30-day warning time and be released from probation I guess you could call it right she does not want to Sandra Jones and Chuck's life no I went to Chuck's life but I couldn't like chat or comment so I watched for a little while and then I left But some people like have, you know, 50 um, channel names, 50 different, you know, things. So sometimes you just don't know who's who. I only have two. Um, but Hug Life was not created to be a troll. Hug Life was there for, um, yeah, I am safe as a mod in your channel. But uh, Hug Life was not sa safe in uh, Big Man, so she got thrown out. Yeah. You gotta go, George. All right, George. Thank you for throwing down links and being my moderator for me. I appreciate it. But um, the reason I created Hug Life was so that I could give two likes, two views, um, even two memberships in some cases to support channels that I like. It was to be extra supportive. Um, it was not created to troll anybody or hurt anybody. And I don't want that channel to be gone. You know. Hug Life's a good gal. <laughs> But Hug Life is uh, has membership on channels that are not 
uh, cop watching or journalism that are told in different genres where hug life is there and eat your broccoli is not um, and she supports channel other types of channels and I don't want her to uh, go away so I'm just gonna tuck her away for 30 days and keep her safe right <laughs> um, I can't this chat it's showing the chat but it doesn't show me like how many people are in here on this how many people are in here can somebody tell me I don't know I don't know because I wasn't planning on staying on that long I was like well if I get thrown off, let me do one last, one last live stream. <laughs> there you go. Thank you, BodyCab911. See, that works. You get an extra thumbs up. And one of the things, like, when uh, Dragonette wanted to be monetized, or um, <laughs> three other people are you. <laughs> well, thanks. But when she needed watch time, I would put on my computer with Hug Life and just put it on a loop and just let her videos play to give her watch time. And then I go, you know, in the other room on my tablet and watch something else. Um, so it helps people when, or Banana Anna when she needed watch time. I did that. Um, not, you know, not commenting on anything or whatever. Just, you know, just let those videos roll and uh, help them get their watch time so that they can get uh, monetized and you know that's I think that's a supportive thing to do and uh, that's what I try to do if I like somebody's channel and pink I don't know if I want to talk in your channel like to comment on a video because I'm scared I let whoever it was doing that scare me I'm afraid if I go make a comment there they'll immediately report it even if I just say, hi, how you doing? Like, get reported for that crap. And they, they were reporting me saying I was being a bully. And I was like, wait a minute. I'm like, I didn't comment on the channel creator. I didn't comment to other people's comments. I didn't bully the police officers that were in the um, video the only thing I said was that uh, I thought their behavior was disgusting and they should be prosecuted for it that I believed it was criminal that's an opinion that's not bullying and then after YouTube looked at it they agreed that it was an opinion so so they let the broccoli free troll is hate speech and bullying for calling somebody a troll well you know they don't I um early on I'd say about a year ago when I watched a video of a cop and I said that he looked like an anorexic emaciated prisoner of war looking motherfucker <laughs> I was like oh yeah that's kind of bullying the cop actually reported it <laughs> because I said that and I was like yeah I learned just like you can't say anything personal to a person that's you could talk about your opinion of their behavior <laughs> the carpet does not match no we're not putting dye down there because that could that might be sensitive <laughs> we don't want any blisters or bumps <laughs> Tapatios, hey, good to see you in here. Thank you for coming in. <laughs> you missed all the crazy flying, though. Um, yeah, Angel Sin was in there trying to give me some little instructions, but there's such a lag time between what I'm seeing and when it actually gets sent out to YouTube. That was kind of a struggle. So... She tries to give me advice on what to practice, and then I just go fly around and do wild shit instead. <laughs> I don't listen very well. That might be why I'm not advancing. She's like, you got to get out of beginner mode and at least make it to intermediate. 
<laughs> She's like, you got to try specific maneuvers. And I like to do everything full throttle. She's like, you got to back off the throttle when you're doing that flip or that trick. I don't know. I don't know if eggplant has... Uh, I told him that I would probably go live today if I got unblocked. Um, but maybe he doesn't have the notification bell on and didn't know I was in here. Margaret popped in for a second. Um, but I'm none of that rest of the California crew found me, so... I don't know. You would think he would be here for me. I'm in every one of his lives. <laughs> I don't know what to I don't know what to like my tracking camera is it working what is it doing it's not working this is it I'm stirring up trouble <laughs> is this the way you stir or this the way you stir I don't know I'm trying to stir up trouble and I'm glad you're here eggplant is probably in YouTube jail also I don't know. I texted him when I was and he didn't say anything about it. I don't think he's left enough comments anywhere to get reported. Bye, Jeff B. Thanks for stopping in. I appreciate it. I appreciate everybody who stopped in and uh, kept me company while I was flying. Um, yes, I'm stirring the pot. I'm stirring the pot. The YouTube comment pot. <laughs> and if I was allowed to say what I really want to say, things would get ugly. I have to, <laughs> my daughter's like, put on your filters before you go in there. <laughs> he lied to you about putting his channel on one of your lives. On one of his lives? Putting, like to um, put your link down? On one of his lives? I'm not sure I understand. Man, eggplant has um, been high on a lot of pain medication. <laughs> and then after that, it was like, uh, he managed to get some weed. Um, so, yeah, I don't know that he's going to remember much of anything. He intends to do things when he says them. He means them. <laughs> But people who smoke weed a lot tend to forget things. They have a lot of plans. <laughs> and I don't smoke weed, so yeah. I just eat gummies. Which they say the psychotropic effects of uh, digesting THC is like five times higher than when you smoke it. So I don't know if that's true or not, but something about the way the liver processes it but I don't I just don't like smoking it's true yeah and sometimes it's like okay I need to go night night and I have issues with sleeping um, so it's like okay I need to I need that to help me sleep um, so sometimes we do that I don't know but you're the same way have trouble with sleeping it's I fall asleep really like I'd be like let me pound down some of these Mike's hard lemonades that'll knock my ass out um, and you it's like drinking a beer and I'll go to sleep super hard and then it's like two hours later I'm awake and thinking about shit so beaver bond is out of the question I don't know what that is <laughs> I, don't know, I don't think I want to know a beaver bong. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't think so. That's why you only have one brain cell left. It's the final brain cell. <laughs> we'll take good care of that little thing and nurture it. Give it lots of vitamins. Keep it alive. <laughs> yeah. Um, I did one time eat a little too much of a chocolate bar because I wasn't sure where the THC was located in that chocolate bar. I ate several squares and I was like, I don't feel anything. <laughs> it's, 
and it was like oh I didn't realize it can take like up to an hour to hit you um, so I ate some more and then I wasn't very happy <laughs> about how I I was <laughs> Joe Cool. Joe Cool was telling stories. What? <laughs> I was watching Johnny Five O talking about drones and stuff and um yeah, I don't want him to look at my drone videos because <laughs> I'm like, what the hell are you trying to do? <laughs> his are all that his are DJI, so they're all nice and smooth and cinematic and perfect and even the FPV flyers that he featured there flying is like, these are expert people. It looks all cool and good. But yeah, my flying is a, a little nauseating, a little floaty, a little out there. But you know, that's what happens when you're a beginner. You, you got to try those little maneuvers and tricks and practice them, you know, a couple hundred times before you get it a few times right and then after you get a few times right you get a few more times right but damn it when I was flying a little earlier I made it through some cement tubes and stuff that is full speed across the, along the ground and through some of those cement tubes that is hard to do it is hard and I made a few of them so I'm proud of myself <laughs> even if nobody else is it's the little achievements that make us happy. <laughs> so I tried to go live when nobody else was live. So like somebody would come in here. But a lot of people were live today. And I didn't chat in anybody's because I, now I'm scared. I'm, the only place I'm not scared is in... in uh, and Chuck Bronson or body cam. Those are the only place I'm feel safe. Everywhere else I'm vulnerable. Even George was timing out his mods and everybody was joking and laughing. I was like, but I can't be in here. I can't afford to be timed out while I'm on warning. So not gonna chat in there. I'll go give it a thumbs up and watch, but no. Nope. And if pink has a wrench anywhere and I don't, I'm definitely not saying nothing. <laughs> I don't trust that fucker now. <laughs> like, come on. I know you apologized, pink, for the timing me out for giving Big Man a super sticker. But I was like, Big Man barely saw the super sticker and you timed me out. I was like, damn it, I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm like, I'm a quitter tonight. I rage quit. No, I didn't rage quit. I just I just quit. Not like I need to go have my binky and sit in the corner. <laughs> well, I think I'm going to end this because I did all my flying and... Uh, it, come on. No, you meant to time her out, and then you're sorry because you thought it was shitty, but I don't, you meant to do it, please. But it didn't even say I was timed out because I tried to say something. You know how you try to type, and it says, oh, you've been timed out by the um, channel operator or the moderator. It didn't even say that. It, I tried to type something, and it said I was blocked. So that's why I left because I was like, uh-oh, and I had to go to uh, my emails and that's when I found out that I was actually blocked. I got blocked right after that. So I don't know if it's a coincidence that I got blocked when you timed me out. Or if it was like, this is just too much. <laughs> You're not listening to the warning. It's too much. No more timeouts. And you know, I don't think timeouts affect you at all. If you're not on warning. But if you're already on warning from YouTube and you get timed out multiple times, like in multiple channels, I think they're like, you got hug life instead. It was an accident. 
But how did Hug Life didn't wasn't in the live chat? It was only on the super sticker. How did you go to the super sticker? I don't even know how you time out a super sticker. Like Hug Life didn't say hi to anybody. She didn't chat at all. She just sent the super sticker. Like how do you time out somebody's super sticker? I don't even think you could do that. <laughs> I know George was having a good time. He's like, I'm timing everybody out. Everybody can come in here and everybody can be in timeout. He's trying to feel better. George timed out 15 socks. Never timed out Murphys. Well, Pink never timed out Broccoli. And, but, um, and he was just playing a game. It was a joke. But it, I think it got me in trouble anyway. But whoever originally reported Hug Life, that's the stinker. Because I've said some pretty racy comments on videos or channels. And as long as nobody reports it, you don't get in trouble. It's whoever's the dumb snitch. Three dots next to a super sticker. I've never even seen that. Like, I've never even tried to click on somebody's super sticker or super chat. <laughs> yeah, George did. <laughs> George is like, Stinker never says hi to me when I say hi to him. I'm going to time him out. <laughs> he sure did. <laughs> but George was like, went on live and he was like on for less than three minutes. Not enough people in here. I'm cutting it off. I could tell he was upset. So I was like, oh, let me call him. He was in here earlier. I was like, let me call him, make sure he's okay. But he turned his phone off too. So I was like, well, how can I cheer you up or talk to you if you turn off your phone? It's like, come on, dude. Don't don't go sulk and withdraw from everybody. That's not going to make it better. You got to at least be able to talk to people. But I guess when you're feeling crappy, maybe that's what you feel like doing is withdrawing from everybody. I don't know. But that's not a good thing. You, <laughs> you don't ever look at your YouTube email. <laughs> well, that could be true, but um, if you if you try to chat after you've been warned, sometimes little something will pop up. Like the when I was when I was first made a bad comment using eat your broccoli. Um, and I was on warning for 30 days, every, if every single chat I made a little box popped up and said, is this following YouTube guidelines? Are you sure you want to make this comment? And then it would have comment anyway or cancel. And that little box would pop up before every single comment. And I was like, oh my God, I couldn't wait for that 30 days to be over. And then I was more careful at least about what I said on um, a static video where people are going to come in and read it later. In a live chat, stuff spins by and maybe people don't go back and read live chat replay in order to complain. You get that box popping up nonstop now. Yeah, it's like, oh my gosh, I just wanted to say, you know, give it a thumbs up and good job. And you got to Look at that stupid little box first before you leave your comment. That stinks. But yeah, I've learned to like say my opinion of the behavior is <laughs> like you you can't say that pimple face cross eyed fat fucker. You can't say that cuz then you're a bully. <laughs> but if that pimple face cross-eyed fat fucker did something egregious you can talk about the egregious behavior because it's your opinion that it's egregious you just can't name call so you have to learn to filter that stuff yeah and my my filters are are turned on most of the time but sometimes when live chat's going by fast i'm i might possibly say something i shouldn't it takes a minute sometimes for that filter to click in. 
And I think, too, like, their guidelines about bullying or whatever, I, I've never seen, like, um, it can't be pornographic or sexually explicit towards an individual. Like, I think you could say, like, I like sex, but you can't say, I want to have sex with you, or I don't want to have sex with you. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I should actually read. The, and you know, when they, when I was uh, on warning, they make you read their guidelines and then click you agree. And if you just try to skim past it and click you agree, they, they won't let you click it. Like you have to take a certain amount of time before you click it or they know you didn't read it. Like they actually want you to read it. <laughs> don't just agree to it. Read it. I'm like, oh, damn it. I'll let this uh, sit here for a minute while I go make some tea. And then I'll come back and agree to it. Because <laughs> I'm not reading through all that crap. But is it like a blue box pink? It like pops up a blue box and and warns you no matter what you're saying. Like every single comment. It made it so I didn't even want to comment on anything. I was just like, let me just get rid of this 30 days and then I'll talk again. I don't know. That's that's where Hug Life is at right now. So she's just going to keep her mouth shut for 30 days. It's a pain. Anyways, I'm going to say goodbye to everybody. Um. <laughs> did you ask that on a live stream? Or did you ask it on a static video comment? <laughs> Where it could be left there to be seen. <laughs> I mean, I've said some pretty naughty things in live streams and nobody's reported it. But I guess some if someone's like just lurking in a live chat and then they could just, anytime somebody says something that's a little off center, they could just click on it and report it over and over again until you get thrown out. It's not very nice, but I guess you, someone could do that. <laughs> Think it was your life? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and I, and I think most people who go into a live stream don't, if they're all adults there, like, People get a, need to get all butt worse. You said way worse and never got hit with the report. Yeah, it's because somebody's mad at you. Oh, Roy, thank you for coming in. I will really appreciate you being here. I'll come lurk in your channel some more. <laughs> I'd love to lurk on your channel and watch the waves and watch your tours. Um, I find it really interesting. So I'll be back. I don't think YouTube actually cares what you say as much. It's just as if it offends someone. It's kind of like if you're cussing in public, you're not going to get that uh, disorderly charge unless there's somebody there to complain about it. If everybody there is like, we don't care, you're not going to get in trouble for it. So... I don't know. But if somebody's mad at you, you <laughs> like the names here. <laughs> oh, you have some pretty good names in your uh, in your live chats too, Roy. I found them interesting as well. <laughs> Diane, you know, I think you all gave Diane too hard of a time. I'm sorry because um, you know she did. She did throw some shade out there, but you guys threw plenty her way. I think she took a lot of crap um, from everybody and from multiple people at the same time. <laughs> yeah, you were lurking and got those free memberships. <laughs> Makes it hard to lurk, doesn't it? <laughs> but I think you all like gave Diane too hard of a time. I mean, I'm not saying I liked everything she said, but... Like, you know, it's like 10 people all slamming on her with bad comments and she's trying to do her best to throw it back and 
she may have gotten a little for many years she's still around I've seen her uh, I've seen Diane comment on some other channels and stuff and I try to say hi to her you know leave a comment for her but um, she didn't respond I don't think she wants to talk to people that are from your chat Chuck I think she's done Well, Roy, you know how I ended up with the name Eat Your Broccoli? It's because I started out with the name Eat a Bag of Dicks and people wouldn't talk to me. <laughs> so I had to change it. <laughs> I had to change it to broccoli so people would talk to me. You were like, oh my God, I don't want to talk to her. You think she's a drunk? I know sometimes like I've had a drink when I'm in your chat, Chuck maybe a, a drink here or there but I don't get drunk drunk I don't do that pills pain pills maybe I know that she was talking about that she was taking gabapentin for nerve pain and gabapentin can make you really emotional like it can make you cry and make you angry and um way up into your emotions i had a nephew that was like a stoic person like always just straight never not a person that would ever cry not a person that was overly emotional um and he started taking that gabapentin and he was like i am crying all day long and i don't know what the fuck i'm crying about <laughs> I don't like the taste of beer tapatillos. That's why I drink Mike's Hard Lemonade. It tastes good and it has about the same alcohol content as a beer. And I could drink one or two of those. And uh, yeah, after two, I might feel just a little bit of a buzz, but not not drunk by any means. I mean, I wouldn't go drive a car, but you know, um, I don't feel so drunk that I I don't know what I'm talking about or that it's affecting what I'm saying. Now, the weed, on the other hand, it's like if I've had too much TAC, THC, um, yeah, that's sort of when I fade off, stop talking, and it's like, okay, is she still here? No, she fell asleep. She fell asleep with a tablet on her chest. <laughs> it's like, no, she's gone. Night-night. She didn't say goodbye. She didn't say anything. She's just, she's taking a nap. I'm like, fall asleep and wake up two hours later and Chuck's on again. <laughs> it's like oh Chuck's still out there <laughs> I'm like you're three hours later than me and I'm like wow it's one o'clock here and you're out there doing a new live stream I'm like what the heck Yeah, some people get really angry if they drink alcohol. And the reason I don't drink a lot of alcohol is because I become your best friend and you can talk me into anything. I become, and I won't remember tomorrow what I did. It's like, get up on that table and dance. I'm like, yeah! <laughs> Let's go rob a liquor store. I'm down! <laughs> like, you can talk me into anything. I'm just be stupid. Um... How do I get my name highlighted like Chuck? I don't know. Chuck, how do you do that? Does it have something to do with the check mark? You put yourself in a box? But yeah, I don't I don't get um, drunk because I don't remember the next day what happened. And yeah, I don't like waking up somewhere and I don't know how I got there or what I did and other people telling me what I did. Um <laughs> go have some drinks <laughs> I only drink at home I don't drink I don't drink ever when I go out ever <laughs> yeah like, I'll buy you a drink <laughs> 100k subscribers if I dance on a table <laughs> dancing naked on a table I don't think YouTube allows that <laughs> <laughs> it's automatic <laughs> no I, 
I think in, in my youth, I've made a fool of myself quite enough to last a lifetime. I don't think I need... <laughs> You're on your way with the sixer. <laughs> <laughs> yes we can drink at the house and then we can like um play cards or play dice or something and until the alcohol kicks in and then we can play some new games <laughs> the only problem is if i don't remember the games the next day what good was it really come on <laughs> You have to have a memory of it to say, yeah, I enjoyed that. So you can't cross that line. And I think, too, there's laws against that, that if someone's so drunk that they can't consent, <laughs> that you're not supposed to do anything. <laughs> That's taking advantage. I'll have to admit, though, probably that happens to a lot of women and they don't report it as anything because they feel like, well, yeah, I got so drunk I don't remember. It's my fault. I shouldn't have drank that much. And it, it, and it is uh, partially her fault, but it's also someone else should have enough respect to not take advantage. But now if they're both sloppy drunk, they might think they did something. They probably both just passed out. <laughs> like, yeah, we had a great time, didn't we? Yeah, I think so. I don't know. I don't remember. Performance may be um, not good if you're full of alcohol. You might lose something there. DJ Smith. <laughs> DJ Smith, did I see you in here earlier? Are you just been lurking? I don't know. <laughs> I'm a good girl. I'm a good girl. I promise. <laughs> but Chuck, if you want to go someplace fun, is VR chat. Yes, VR chat. You, you there's this, there's the strip club. Um, there's all you like all kinds of stuff going on it's um all adult content and uh yeah you don't get reported for that you can say whatever you want and uh of course everybody is beautiful in vr chat with beautiful bodies because you know you could be like a 500 pound person and go into vr chat and look good but um yeah it tracks like you do, can get uh, cameras to do head-to-toe tracking and dance and uh, uh, have a good time. And uh, hey, friends in code. Um, sorry, I'm not scratching my hair. I'm actually rubbing my eye. That hand tracking's a little bit off. <laughs> it's kind of set on the desk uh, out in front of me, so it, in it. Yeah, like I'm, wait, where's my head? I can't find my, I, huh, hands, wait, huh, hands up. <laughs> you lurk everywhere on YouTube. I do too. Lurking's cool. You know, lurking's good. As long as you hit that thumbs up and give somebody view time, lurkers are good. Um, yeah. I sometimes I like to watch you Chuck I put on my uh, VR headset and watch YouTube from this is my hands are in front of my eyes just in case you can't tell <laughs> um, and I watch you it's like watching you on the on a big movie screen so like some of your videos is like oh I'm gonna go rewatch that in uh, VR um, Look like, yeah. Oh, wait, where's that? Wait, where's that armpit? <laughs> I'm gonna tick your head. I'm tucking my head. It's not showing. Sniffing my armpit. But yeah, there's a lot of fun stuff you can do in VR that you can't do on YouTube. There's not as. If it's all adults in the room, in the chat, or in the whatever you're doing. Poker with Bow. I do have a play date for later in VR to play some mini golf. Um, 
that I found a friend because I just left it op like open so that anybody could join me. And a young man, he sounds like he's maybe 20. Um, and he's very polite and respectful and doesn't cuss. Um, I think maybe either his mom or somebody listens to him while he's playing. So he calls me dude. Maybe a girlfriend, huh? Because he calls me dude all the time while we're playing. And like, oh, he's just playing with some of his buddies. Might, she might get mad if uh, they knew it was a woman he was playing with. Yes. Like, like I put my heart, hands out right here and like... See, I've got two cameras tracking. I've got one that's tracking my head and mouth and eyes. And then I've got one that's tracking my hands. It's not set up quite right now because my keyboard's in the way. Um, but, so it's sitting a little further over my desk. Um, so it tracks my hands, like hands and arms. Um, but in the VR, you can have um, your camera set up so it's tracking from head to toe so you can dance or um, play different games. Uh, like sometimes I'll meet a friend and we'll go into the carnival or... Um, well, sometimes I just meet a friend and we go watch a movie together in uh, the movie lounge and sit next to each other and watch a movie on the big screen and talk and like throw pop fake popcorn or something. I don't know. Silly stuff. But it's fun. I like VR. I spend... When I'm not on YouTube, that's where I'm at. I'm in VR. Um, but watching YouTube videos on uh, VR, you can still go to the uh, uh, chat on a static video and leave a comment, but you have to use the pointer of the controller in like one letter at a time. You know, just it's slow to leave a comment. Um, but if it's live, I can watch the live stream on VR, but you can't get live stream chat on the VR so you can just watch the video but you can't chat with anybody which I do sometimes like if I don't really care I'm not in the mood to talk to anybody I'll just like let me watch this on VR and there might be some little nuances that happen like when cops are beating the crap out of somebody that you might not see if you're looking on your phone or a small device and but if you look at in VR it's like on the big movie screen like you can notice some stuff that you didn't notice otherwise it um it's head goggles it's the uh, oculus oculus 2 is what it is and it used to be that you had to have a facebook account to run uh your oculus 2 but now you don't they've changed the rules on that but there's a lot of fun stuff in there you can go in there and do stuff by yourself or you can uh get together and like um, leave a message for your friends so that your friends can come in uh, to play games with you or you can leave it open so a total stranger can come play with you and sometimes I I'll, if I'm um, playing mini golf um, that's a good one um, because there's not a bunch of noise in the game that you can and you have your headsets on so you just talk to each other um, you don't have to type, you know, to talk to each other. And there's not, a, if, if you're in a, like an action game, like pistol whip, where it's loud and noisy, um, you're not going to be able to like talk to somebody and get to know them that way. Um, cause it's all crazy and loud. Uh, but so if you want to like, like I have a friend who, uh, can you make yourself people do you can make yourself look like a character or you can make yourself look like a furry creature um if you go on uh youtube and uh look for a video to what like what vr chat looks like or um vr lap dances or there'll be videos that are posted um that you can see what it looks like but yeah there are people there's this one guy who had like a social anxiety disorder that came into VR chat and his name was Toaster 
and he used to go sit on the counter behind the bar and just like crouch down like he was a toaster where is VR um, it's in it's inside the oculus headset you um, you make an avatar and you can go into VR chat but you won't have a body or a body movement unless you get the extra cameras um, tracking cameras to set that up. You only want to be a gremlin in the bar all drunk. Well, <laughs> but the guy Toaster, he sat on the counter for months and would just listen and be in the room and people would go up and say hi to him and he didn't really talk. And then finally he started talking to this one girl and then eventually he started talking to everybody. Um, like brought him out of his social anxiety disorder and he made friends. So it's good for that. Like if you're scared to be around actual people, but you want to talk to people, you can, you know, or I don't know, let's say if you were a burn victim and you looked horrible, you could go into VR chat and like have a totally, uh, handsome, a VR character or pretty VR character so you felt confident to um, go talk to people and have a good time um, without being self-conscious of how you look. It'd be a place for you to go and stay connected with people so you don't feel isolated. Where do you remember me from? <laughs> DJ Smith. <laughs> I see you all over in chats like Chucks or um, I don't know any kind of cop watching videos um, I'm trying to think well I've seen you multiple multiple places now my character I, I will tell you guys a little secret my gaming character and uh, my VR character are not named Eat Your Broccoli I've kept the sort of separate genres, keep everything separated um, when I'm playing games and stuff. It it depends on how you read it. I laugh all the time. So my, my daughter's like, what would be a good name for you? And I was like, well, what about Laura's laughter? And she goes, well, it's going to be jammed all together. And so when she wrote it down and it's jammed all together, you could re put the S with Laura and it's Laura's laughter, or if you put the S in the front of laughter instead, then it's Laura's slaughter. And I'm like, Laura's slaughter. I'm like, good, that's perfect. <laughs> so, so that's my, uh, that's my, this is, that's actually my, this v -Roy character's name right here. It only says eat your broccoli because I'm live streaming as eat your broccoli. But the character's name is Laura slaughter. Not that I slaughter or slay and so good at <laughs> yes. <laughs> but it's all it's like all jammed together one one word. So it just depends. Is the S with Laura or is it with laughter? Is it Laura Slaughter? Laura's laughter. Because I'm always laughing. But all in how you look at me. I don't know, but I've been on here way too long, and uh, yeah, I have to go pee. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm gonna end this because <laughs> I gotta go. Um, but I I'm want to thank everybody who who came. You don't want to hear about that. Girls have to pee too. <laughs> you don't want me to pee in the closet, do you? <laughs> George laughs at me. He's like, "Are you claustrophobic? You." You sit in the closet? I'm like, yes, I do. <laughs> I don't need a walk-in closet because I don't have, like, oh, I have designer dresses and, you know, uh, 100 pairs of sh shoes. I'm, like, full of Jimmy Choo's or something. Um, no, I just have, like, my one long dresser along the wall in the closet and the rest of it's all uh, electronics. Well, thank you, Tapatios thank everybody for coming in and uh, yeah we'll do this again sometime it's been lovely 
It's been lovely. I'll love to see you again. <laughs> and Chuck, you know, I'll be looking for you. <laughs> all right, everybody. You all take care and uh, have a good rest of your evening. All right. Um, bye now. Where's my stop streaming button? Oh, there it is. See you later, guys. <laughs> you looking for George Ward? George was in here earlier. He was here. Thank you, Chuck, for coming in. Thank you, Murphus. Thank you, Tepatius. DJ Smith, Roy. Um, I didn't even know you were connected to me, Roy. I've been lurking in your channel for like a year. And uh, only recently said something to you. Pink, you're still here? <laughs> Dang it, Pink, you lurker. <laughs> uh, Laura, now you're going to call me Laura Slaughter, huh? <laughs> All right, you guys, take care. It